action. Hello, I'm Mark and that's Liam from Wise Up and today I wanted to talk to you about e-cigarettes. So, um, being an ex-smoker and someone who used to use e-cigs and vapes, I know how readily available um, they are and I also know about how there is a lot of promotion around the fact that they are safe. Um, and really, I suppose to some extent, if you're comparing them to something that definitely gives you cancer and can kill you, they might be a touch safer. But the real truth is, and if you ask any expert or do any research, we don't honestly know the long-term effects of e-cigs and vapes. Um, we just know they're probably maybe not quite as bad as cigarettes. Um, but definitely, I wouldn't be going into this thinking that they are risk-free. Yeah, we're hearing um, more and more times of things happening um, with young people, with adults also, um, and these things being laced, um, you know, it might be with um, THC, with spice, and not really knowing what's in them. Um, there might be immediate effects sometimes that things can happen um, when this happens, or it might be the long-term effects, but the fact is we don't really know. They're relatively new on the scene, um, and I, I think you're playing a bit um, a very dangerous game, um, just thinking and presuming that they're, they're okay and safe. Um, I think stopping, if you've already started, whether it's smoking or vaping, stopping can be really, really difficult. Um, I would argue it's one of the most difficult addictions um, to come off. Um, so I know that can be really difficult. So honestly, I'm standing in front of you now, as someone who's had to do it, the easiest thing would be not to do it at all in the first place. Um, now, your school's got a zero tolerance policy to these things. You know, you sh obviously shouldn't be smoking um, and vaping until you're 18 anyway. Um, and it's for good reason, it's for your health, it's for the risks that are associated. Um, so you need to be really, really careful. However, we are realist and, uh, and we've been young um, once, quite a long time ago, um, but we're realist, we are aware that some students will be doing it. And one thing I will say is if you are gonna do it, buy it from somewhere that's reputable um, and safe really. We're not promoting that far from it. Liam said the please try and stay away from it. But we are aware that these things happen. So just please make sure you're, you're very, um, very careful. Now, one thing we wanted to avoid on this video, I don't want to use like scare tactics and all that sort of stuff, but um, it wouldn't take you very long to find out if you go on Google at some of the really sad stories um, and instances and things that have gone on, not just in the UK, but around the world. Um, there's been a lot of cases of deaths in America uh, with certain fluids. Uh, we have had some over here in this country. So, you know, this isn't a um, myth. These are people who are losing their lives through this sort of stuff. So if you are, if we can't stop you, and if you are gonna use an e-cig or vape, as Mark's already said, reputable su suppliers, registered manufacturers that are licensed, checked and validated. Um, and if you are worried about anything at all, please come forward. Whilst, whilst your school or your parents and us would rather you not do it, if you are and you're worried, I'd equally rather you have a conversation and talk to someone about it than try and find your own way with it. To try and end the video on a little bit of a high, we've had a really tough year um, and we just wanted to say do all you can um, to look after yourself. I think you've got to go above and beyond to look out for your friends as well. So if you are worried about a friend that's doing this, challenge them. Um, but if you are struggling with anything else or you've got any questions after you watch this video, we're on social media, we're on the doorstep of your school, um, but we hope you have a lovely Christmas and look after yourself. And just remember, keep going, keep strong. If we can do it, so can you. Wise up.